Kabala, no more so. 4.5 kilometers. You are welcome. 25 30 minutes away, but he left over there before me. So we were able to use up your way to come here before him. Uh, he stayed behind, but we cannot wait. So, um, this is the little we can do. We are not in government, but then we have friends in government. And because we also have friends in Isukwato, I have friends in Emuaswa. Uh, this is a route that I apply every time and um, I thought I should bring my influence to get the road done and this is just the beginning Amen. 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 Because there are a lot of other things that need to be done and the whole idea of offering ourselves to serve is to make life easier for you yes, and that is what it is for us anybody who aspires to leadership who does not think of making life easier for the people who does not think of welfare of the people who is owing salaries when people have worked who is paying owing pensioners and they are dying of hunger that person doesn't understand what leadership is all about yes. for us leadership is about service is about making life better for people. It's about impacting and we will continue to do it, irrespective of whether we are in government or not. Yes. So I hereby wish to dedicate this 4.5 kilometer road, uh, which has been completed and I dedicate it in the name of the Father. Yeah. And in the name of the Son, yeah. and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Senior brother, Lieutenant General Dunyanko, in America. The, my brother, the senior advocate of Nigeria, Ken Ahia. Akasha Watanankwe, Engineer TPK Achibu. Another brother of mine, Victor Onyem Pan. I'm sure he's somewhere. Yeah. My lifetime woman leader, high tension. Oh. Oh. The things, ladies and gentlemen, I want to stand on existing protocols. Let me thank the Umwaswa community for this honor they have done me. I wasn't actually expecting it. And um, so I'm a bit surprised because if you expect that they, an individual, no matter how much money you have, you cannot make an impact because four kilometers of road, I understand it's 4.5 kilometers of road. This is in billions. So we had to use contact and use federal government to come and build the road. Yes, the original, road, the original location was about two kilometers. And we had to suspend a road somewhere to get it up to 4.5 kilometers. But we are not done because there is still a lot of the roads in Umwaswa that need to be done. So as the federal government is resolving the problems of NDDC, we'll go back to them to come and complete the job. One of the big 
major reasons that I offered myself for election in this state is not because I'm a politician, I'm not one. But I know that if you want to make maximum impact, you need government. Yes, sir. You need power. Yes, sir. You need authority. Yes, sir. And that is why we say that anybody who is in government and does not know that he needs to use government to impact people rather than punish people, that person does not understand what leadership is all about. Yes. And our prayer is that as we go into the next phase, that all of us will be a bit more careful and a bit more involved. Because we can do better with leadership. Yes, sir. Never again should we allow people who don't understand the essence of leadership get into leadership positions. And it's not about me, it is about all of us. Yes, sir. Abia State has not made any progress. And if you go to the neighboring Ebony State with little money, you will see what leadership has done. We can do better here. So distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I know the time is fast spent. I want to thank you most sincerely. Thank your Royal Highness for this honor. And I pray that all of us will see 2021 in good health. So once again, compliments of the season and God bless you.